everyone hope you all are doing well welcome to university of mysore in today's video i am going to tell you about the university's uh, student portal all right that you will receive after the approval so now let's start with the student portal like what kind of things we have in our portal and how will you give your exams and everything so let's start this is our portal as you can see in your screens this is our portal in which we have many things in the dashboard in our home sections so in this we have learn collaborate and communication report card your en university enrollment assignment quizzes and evaluation fee schedule and history and then demo and training videos so in these all the topics we have like in learn we have courses that whatever course you are enrolled with all the uh, resources will be there and in the collaborate and communication the notification and inbox section is there with the discussion forum uh, in report card we have progress report okay and in your university enrollment details we have your enrollment detail grade card and certificate and the current contact details of yours then we have assignments quizzes and evaluations all right in which in this section you can give your internal external your projects everything then we have fee schedule and history in this you can see your payments and everything now we have demo and training videos in which you can also see this as like a demo, demo training like how to use your portal and how to go through with that so let me just brief you about everything step by step now let me just come to the learn section that is this in this we have your courses okay so whatever course you are enrolled with in whatever program so all the courses and all the material subject wise we have here okay see as you can see all the subjects are here okay in this course section you will get three resources to study that is e content e tutorial and web resources so let me just go through with that like we have three resources so let me just tell you about those see i have just clicked on one of the uh, course okay that is corporate finance so in this we have e tutorial e content and web resources all the three contents are there so e tutorial it basically is your uh, recorded lectures okay that are for you and then e contents are the pdf format okay in a pdf format and web resources are the additional reference material for you okay so now if i talk about the tutorial like our recorded lectures okay in this we have a video of our professor teaching you regarding your concepts everything step by step maximization of shareholders so, for wealth example, let reserves let open what has been traditionally looked at as See, an like objective kind of, of a business and form a partnership form all right That's or we could be talking about a company form an organization more commonly referred to as a corporate of a business and from a partnership form. this is our professor we could be okay. talking about a company because it is money organization. any organization would then be asking the, it would require more funds so then the organization because it is money any organization would then be asking it would require more funds so let the organization so this is the recorded video that we have okay in your portal we have this session by session you can just see all the videos are in a clear visible okay you can see these okay and you can study then next we have e content so in e content basically it is a pdf in a pdf format so like this it's kind of a book you can see here see these are the books material we have like a pdf format we have these like this so in this you can see you can study like this in all the topics are step by step only so it's very easy to you to study right next we have the web resources like the additional reference material for you guys in the pdf format only like this so see it's a very clear pdf format that you will be able to study further 
so yeah in this courses section you can see every course of yours okay like whatever in program you are enrolled with us so every subject are there see all the subjects are there in all the subjects we have these resources all right so this is all about our courses like in our the uh, our courses tab now let's just go with the next that is collaborate and communication section so in this we have the notification and inbox discussion forum okay and external communities so basically in notification and inbox whatever notification will be come from the university it will be here only okay you can just see here okay you can just go through with that okay now let me just come up with the main thing that is assignments quizzes and evaluation so once you are done with your studies okay you have uh, read everything like you have watched the videos and everything and now you want to offer the exams so we have two exams with us that is internal and externals okay so if you want to give the internal examination right if you want to offer the internal examination so this is the section you need to click here okay in the internal assessment in uh, in the portal it is also written as continuous assessment okay we have two internals internal 1 and internal 2 so in this you can just uh, right now the student has already given the internals so once he sees here she hasn't given so if you want to give your internals you need to click here in the start exam okay whenever you will click on the start exam your internal assessment will get started and further you will be able to give your internals it will all mcq based like internals will be of your mcq base it just you need to uh, click one option only so you need to just click here on the start exam and you need to uh, proceed with your examination so once you have given internal 1 and internal 2 the course will be uh, the scores will be visible automatically okay like this out of 15 12 out of 15 2 like this the course will be visible immediately now the internal part is over right you have given the internals now you want to go off for the external we have external examination also right so you want to go for the external examination so we have a section of external exam also So you need to just click here. So once you will click here, the external examination section will be there for you. Okay? See like this. See like this. So whenever you want to, you know, go with the, uh, you know, you want to opt for your external, you just need to book your slots. Okay? Whenever you want to opt for your external, for external, you need to book these slots. So right now, uh, already the student has booked his slots, right? Book booked her slots. So now you will be not able because uh, if see student already had uh, booked his exam, right? So uh, if you had hasn't booked the exam, so in this section it will come like a book exam. So you need to book that. we have slots okay you need to book slots 24 hours before appearing for the examination so this is our section for the internal and external as we have two examinations only that is internal and external now let me come up with the project so if you have any kind of project in your uh, courses okay if you had any project the projects will be shown up here only like in this course there are no project so that's why it is written as no enrolled project course form so if you have any project the project will be come up here now we have summer internship and then viva so in so so as you can see like we have summer internship and viva so uh, in summer internship so uh, in your courses we have the summer internship also okay so if you have any kind of summer internship report or project work diary so it will come like this as you can see right so uh, you need you need to upload your summer internship report here and your project work here only okay then we have viva if in your course there is a viva so 
everything will be here in this course there is no viva so it is written as no enrolled course found okay now let me come up with the next that is report card and you can also say it as a progress report so in this section you will find all the things like how much time you have given to your practice time and how much to the like how how much time you have given to your portal right and you last log in and everything so in this total logging time is there in red section okay total practice time in yellow to uh, last login date with the time exact time in blue thing so like it see our portal uh, records everything like how much you have given your time in our portal to study right so there is graphs also so this graph is for the course wise progress graph okay like how much you have given a uh, time to a particular course right now we have total time spent on e tutorial e content and web resources like how much time you have given to the resources that we have okay so this is the graph you can see okay now let's come up with the next that is university enrollment okay in this section we have in enrollment details contact details grade certificate and university notification so in enrollment detail we will have your details like your name your registration number your course your date of birth your father name mother name your program which you are enrolled with us your enrollment date your uni student id or you can see roll number okay and also you can view your application from here you just need to click here and you can view your application now we have the contact details of yours like your mail id and your phone number okay now the next section is of your grade and certificate so in this section see you have given your examination and everything and you have scored right so in this section you will find your grades okay see all the uh, subject wise there are grades so there will be a course name semester credit total achieved total out of grade grade point and status like pass fail okay so this is your grade card and certificate okay now let me just tell you about the section that is university notification in this uh, see this is the same only okay if you get any notification from university and you will get it here only now let me just tell you about the next that is fee schedule and history so in this section it is also known as online payment so in this section if you had paid right your payment details will be there so now this student has already made the full payment so that's why it is showing like a full okay so if you had made the payment like semester wise or uh, you have made the payment on installment okay uh, you have taken the course of 3 years and the payment will be of 3 year right so all the details are there okay will be there in your portal right now the student has the made payer uh, made the payment for the full payment so that why it is showing like this also this is the payment details then we have the transaction history see you can see your transaction history also like when you have paid your uh, fee and like your installments and everything when you have paid your examination fee so everything will be there in the transaction history so in section in this section basically you can see your transaction details right So next we have demo and training videos. So in this section we have the training videos like whatever whatever I have told you in this video right you can also see it in our demo thing okay in this section you will have these all the topics you can see how to use the portal and everything how can you give your internal and external okay see we have report card section post a discussion notification internal assessment fee payment external external communities enrollment details chat and meeting blog class calendar self assessment and proctored examination methodology okay so you can just see everything here and also let me just tell you one thing in our portal okay that will help you very much so in our portal there is a section of a live chat see here this is the section of a live chat 
so if you face any of the issue related to portal or any issues okay if you face any issues you can just click here in the live section live chat section and you just need to click here okay and there will be a option of send us a message our student support team will be there to help you anytime you just need to type your issue here okay and send and they will be there to help you back okay regarding anything they will help you all the time so this is the option for the live chat okay that we have in our portal so you can also chat with our support team so i hope that you will you will like this video okay and i hope this video helps you to understand about our university portal and you will get to learn many things from our university okay i hope you have a great journey with our university okay thank you so much have a great day